In order to end the new world order, we must first change our diets. We need to switch from a diet that is based on processed foods and GMO crops, which are not only harmful for our health, but also damaging for the environment. Instead, we should, fo we should focus on eating organic food that is free of toxins and full of micronutrients and minerals. Eating this kind of food helps us stay healthy while also helping protect nature around us. The second thing we need to do in order to achieve freedom in the new world order is educate ourselves about science with an open mind. Science today often focuses too much on money, making instead of learning more about real solutions, like free energy sources, or ways how people can live sustainably without harming their own health or depleting natural resources, like landfills, etc. Therefore, it's important that everyone gets educated properly so they know what's really going on behind closed doors when it comes down to big companies making decisions out there, as well as everyday life choices people make every day such as buying products made with artificial ingredients, etc. Lastly, let's not forget religion, something many might think has nothing to do with having freedom, but actually does. Religion teaches morality which serves at least two purposes. Firstly, it tells us how society should be organized morally speaking e. g. Respect each other. Secondly, some religions teach spiritual knowledge, even if you don't believe them all, which could help one become more conscious about living a sustainable lifestyle where everything works together harmoniously within nature itself, thus ultimately leading towards freedom.